Welcome back once again to Let's Keep It Real. I am back with another video for you all. Y'all, what is Stunner Girl talking about? Where she said some things about Ray J, you know? Uh, about Ray J and uh, Wendy Williams, okay? What is going on? Okay, so before we get started, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Let's Keep It Real and turn on those post notifications so you'll know when these new videos are coming out because we got to spread this video, okay? We got to spread these videos. And, uh, y'all yeah, forgot my thought. Uh, <laughs> okay, and everything that we discuss is alleged and we cannot confirm nor deny because we was not there and we don't know what these people are thinking, okay? Okay. So, let's get on into it. What is Stunner Girl talking about, you all? Like I said, we can't confirm nor deny anything, but it's a story out, you all, and uh, and it's talking about Stunner Girl accuses Ray J of pushing Dragon's binge on Wendy Williams. She ain't been the same since. So, he is pushing Dragon binges is what they saying, is what she's saying that he did. Stunner Girl accuses Ray J of pushing Dragon binge on... Wendy Williams, she ain't been the same since, is what the allegations have been made against Ray J, okay? Okay, so, uh, and it's saying that Ray J was encouraging Wendy Williams to consume dragons amid the fallout from their business relationship allegedly going sour. Ooh, what, what secrets does she know? Sunna Girl addressed Ray J 43 in a post uploaded to her Instagram story yesterday, Monday, June 24th, writing, instead of constantly being worried about me, Ray J needs to focus on what he did to Wendy Williams. We can't confirm nor deny. She ain't been the same since you took her on that dragon binge gang. What is this? Y'all, y'all, you know, we've heard the stories about, um, Ray J and you know what I'm saying and him participating in dragons and current on okay and, and now the latest accusation is with Wendy Williams but you know in the past it was about our beloved Whitney Houston okay and we know about the whole story so I'm not gonna get into all of that because like I said I can't confirm nor deny may this woman rest in peace Whitney Houston the greatest okay the greatest, do you understand? As you may know, media maven Wendy Williams has been open and honest about her struggles with addiction and most, and she documented and she recently discussed it in her docuseries, excuse me. While it's been known that the TV veteran has had a friendship with Ray J in the past, there have been no indications that Stunner Girl has any evidence to support her claims, nor has she elaborated on the matter any further. So she's she's not elaborated on it and, and nobody has any evidence to support what she said, but evidently she's... I don't know what, what done went on with her and Ray J. Lord, where she talking about he don't need to be worrying about her, but uh, so she, he done pissed her off is basically what it's sounding like, okay? Really. It's also unclear what exactly prompted the Sacramento artist to attack the Love and Hip Hop alum, though social media users did claim that Stunner Girl quietly made other accusations about Ray J three weeks ago, shortly after announcing that she and her husband were ending their business relationship with Ray J. And y'all, you know Ray J, he's tied, he done been tied with so many different people in the past, i.e. Kim Kardashian. Uh, you know, his, his late, his, his, his ex-wife soon to be, are they divorced yet? You all his soon to be ex-wife or ex-wife. Uh, I don't even see how princess love married him for real. I'm not, I'm not going to even lie. I know I'm getting off subject, but I'm just like, why does she marry him? Oh, I forgot it was the money. Apparently Stunner Girl created and launched her, uh, Red Rum TV app, Red Rum, Red Rum, and went into business with Ray J after having, success as a Zeus Network reality star. Her husband, however, shared in a live video a few weeks ago that they were parting ways with Ray J due to wanting to work with his wife independently to produce content. Meaning, we ain't got time for no middleman. We gonna handle this on our own. Ain't no need for no more middleman, okay? Cutting a piece of our pie. You know, we just gonna go on and, and eliminate him out of the scenario and we gonna get this money together, husband and wife. We don't need no Ray J. That's what that meant. Despite him insisting, the situation ended amicably. 
Stunninger apparently took offense to something Ray J said about her afterward, seemingly writing in response at the time. Stop speaking on me. You're none but a Hollywood kid who's having a midlife crisis at 50, faking a gangster image mm, once you couldn't pay us for clout and my husband for protection anymore. Whoa. And you started trying to be him. You even tattooed your face like him or like he is left, left my, you know what I'll buy. Oh my goodness. So Ray J, she basically saying he's a faker. Y'all a faker, a faker. Well, you know, we knew Ray J grew up with money because of Brandy. We know that. So, you know, well, y'all, do we need to go any further? We know half of these people out here is not what they rapping about. Okay, they ain't what they rapping about. Allegedly, we can't confirm nor deny. But I, I don't, I, I see what she's saying because Ray J do be sitting up there talking all like he this, that, and the third. Okay, and you be like, boy, you was born with a silver spoon in your mouth. What is you talking about? What is you saying? And you walking around huffing and puffing like you big and bad, do, for real, dude. For real, what is really going on? You know, you ain't got to lie, Craig. You ain't got to lie. I mean, and later adding, you pay for. I, I'm trying to figure out what word did you <laughs> You pay for cakes all day. Was that a good word? <laughs> you pay for cakes all day, but won't pay your team. You're a professional. J-O-H-N. You was gassing Sook saying you had her sign an NDA after you got some of that cakes. Mm, bees can't be on your network. Less they sexy pleasing you your biggest creep of all of them or am I you the biggest creep of all of them yeah I am so sorry I'm trying to decipher what I'm reading okay so please bear with me it does not appear that Ray J has responded publicly to Stunner Girl well she's pissed y'all she's pissed with but with him running his mouth and she's like you know what I, I I'm not mm -mm. she's like I'm not going for that you know and I don't blame her Stunner Girl's post about him at that time so what are y'all thoughts on this, guys? Because evidently, like I said, Ray J done pissed her off and, and they're they not going for it no more. They're like, we don't need you no more. You keep your mouth off of me. Keep my name out your mouth, little boy, is what she... Uh, I mean, I'm not going to put words in her mouth. But keep your mouth off of me, little boy. Want to be gangster. You know, that's 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 what it's given. Okay, that's what it's given. And... uh. You know, Ray J just needs to go and take that loss and take that big old L and go about his business. You know, it didn't work out. That's business. It didn't work out. But uh, anyway, guys, what y'all think about all of this? Because as I said, you know, he, uh, they're saying he, you know, this, according to Stunner, Stunner girl, she said, you know, Wendy ain't being right, but she, nothing else has been said after that. Okay. And, and, you know, the rumors out there about uh, Ray J and, and Whitney and Whitney. Okay. We know the rumors. What is Ray J doing? What's going on with him? You know what I'm saying? I mean, I feel like he's been trying to uh, uh, trail behind Brandy for years, okay? Don't get me wrong. If I had one wish, I mean, we could be best friends. I love that song, y'all. I'm not going to lie. I love that song. But Ray J needs to have several seats and, and quit trying to start a bunch of nonsense and be happy with what you got. You, why couldn't he be worried about his marriage, okay? That's the problem. He out here mad cause, uh, uh, because what's a girl, what's her name? Uh, she done got tired, Princess. She got tired of this nonsense. And, and you know, and she was like, I'm done. I'm tired of dealing with this. You know, and I don't blame her either. You know, but he should have been focusing more on his wife and his family. I know I don't get off track, but whatever. Uh, he should have been focusing on his family, okay? And then he wouldn't be having time to be saying this and saying that and doing this, and this, that, and the third, okay? That's all I'm going to say about this whole situation. Because really, you we could go, we could, some more stuff could be, talked about for Ray J, you know, because he don't get talked about enough, okay? Because we be seeing him moving. We be seeing him. We be seeing him. But don't nobody be saying nothing about him. That's the thing. But anyway, guys, what's y'all thoughts on this about what Stunner Girl said, okay? She done exed out the middle, man. We don't need you. We don't want you. We don't want you no more, okay? And uh, drop your comments in the comments section below. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Let's Keep It Real, okay? Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And I thank all the new uh, subscribers that have subscribed because I've been seeing y'all subscribing, y'all. So thank you all for subscribing here. Uh, I wouldn't be let's keep it real if I didn't say something smart, okay? But anyway, I really appreciate you all uh, subscribing and taking the time to watch my video. And I'll be back soon with another video for you all.